okay and we like to chill and watch tv and we're back with episode 17 of vikings this one is the raft of medusa so we're on our way to england and when i say we i have our visitor and hair with three episodes to go you can already tell this isn't gonna go well because at the end of the last one like, yeah, Harold gave his speech and it seemed like he kind of got a couple people on our side, but like, Ivar came through with like the homecoming speech and the gym went wild. That's gonna be a problem. He said he didn't care about the throne. He doesn't care about the throne, but I am still under the opinion that what Harold really cares about is everybody liking him. And it just never happens. Not for real. Nobody ever likes him for real. He might do some legendary shit. Maybe. I mean, to give Harold his credit in previous seasons, he did do good in battle. I will give him that. Now, has his thirst for power led him a little astray? Also, yeah. Do I feel like him and Ivar are going to eventually have some very big beef? Yep. And I think he's going to try and just have Ivar and Vitzer die in Wessex. Could be wrong. Then we got Uva, who is lost as he. Trying to find a home. Trying to find his golden land that Oterra told us about. I now have a very out there theory when it comes to Oter, only because he keeps bringing uber's faith up like oh you haven't lost faith have you and then he telling torby like oh we have a problem because uber lost his faith like are you here to test us sir because like vitzerk saw god and they did whatever and she was gone the next morning did whatever look he got some god ass or goddess ass. Anyways, he had his visit. She was gone in the morning. His what? Maybe Oter is like a god visiting, playing a trick on us. He trying to see where Uba Hart at. Been doing this for a long time, sir. That is also true. That's why I said it's like an out there theory. But I just find it weird, like, the story keep changing, but he keep bringing Uba Faith into it. And I don't understand why. Like, sir, if you were born a Viking that took the identity of somebody and took his faith, why are you bothering this man? Like, I mean, that's what Ivar said about the roots. He said uh, Christianity infected them and stuff. Yeah, that he did say it was spreading like a plague. I don't know, man. I think that's it. That's the end of the Vikings. Not as a culture, but... Yeah. I see this being the end of our favorites. Like, with us going to Wessex with three episodes left, I feel like... King Alfred about to murk their ass. Either Alfred gonna kill... Alfred gonna kill one of them. And I'm gonna go with Harold. Alfred's probably gonna take out Harold. Ivar is having issues and his daddy did love to be over there. Maybe Ivar and Vic so could say screw it and they'll stay. There's really nothing for y'all in Kattegat anymore. Y'all both already said you don't feel like your destiny is here. Ivar saw the seer. The seer kind of confirmed it for a little bit. So maybe they'll stay there. Maybe Uba will find his golden land and nobody will come the fuck back to Kattegat for real. America. Let's figure it out. Let's go. You trust them? Well, of course. Of course I do not trust them. They lie about everything. When we send each other, I also lie. <laughs> okay. We are making good your fleet. This place always reminds me of the, the great ship built of Loki. Did we just break Loki up? How dare you, Harold? Yeah, who's building these boats? You know him. You didn't know him. Gone now. Perhaps all the 
best ones are gone. They are. Luca used to say that this. I hope our craftsmen are as skillful as he was. Me too. They're not. You've got to make it to me. They will, but they're not. In which case, it needs to be someone in charge here who I can trust to defend the tower. Oh, hell no. We have my interests. We're going to put Eric in charge, really? This is your home. No, it's not. The Gattaca. Officially, you and Ingrid will rule in my absence. Things are coming to a conclusion. Eric the Red, whatever. What do you mean, coming to a conclusion? I'm not entirely sure, but I can feel it in my bones. Why is she dressed like an Arizona iced tea? I ordered that you and Eric should be joint rulers in my absence. I can I can organize the defenses. <laughs> you will be joint rulers. That is my decision. She said I could do that shit by myself. Which? Why leave your land so soon? I'm a Viking. Duh, bitch. I'm not one for a set. That's what I do. Oh, back to Gilligan's Island. They look terrible. How is your bodyguard not going with you? He ain't coming back. Nobody is coming back. Man, listen. Saw what you did in that cave. Oh my goodness. Not in the words. What? He's looking kinky. I don't trust this motherfucker. <laughs> I thought she was about to kill that bubble. I want to see the marks. <laughs> this is what turned Anchor on for real? some respect on that. You know what it is. You know what we're here for. You know how we're coming. That's why we should stop trying to be invisible. On the contrary, we should announce our presence. Start spreading terror in the local population. It's a You've 
rushed in and agreed to their terms. Damn. Right. But for the most part, they don't need Oh, shit. <laughs> what what you doing? doing, Ingrid? Mushrooms. Some of those might be poisonous. What was that? What was that? Poison. Fuck. She a real life witch. What the fuck, Ingrid? She gonna get rid of air gas. But I feel like it was way easier way. Look. It was way easier way to do that than all of that. That's food right there. I feel like that was a trap. depressing oh fuck is everybody dead almost Oh no, it's happening. She told everybody she was a witch. She was a witch. Just think, her son, all of this would be out. Everything as far as the eye can see. What the fuck is this? Sandals? Lion King? Arrows. Huh? Seems to me that King Alu's days are probably numbered. Would you agree? Both of us? 
Now what? Both on. Damn. Eric gonna be a little seer. Just on the boat. What you see? What do you see? Is that land? Damn. Made it work though. Hopefully not to no more bullshit. Where's my flow key? All right, that was it for episode 17, The Raft of Medusa. I don't know what Medusa had to do with that. I was just thinking about that. Let me know. Yeah, if y'all found that connection, I'm very curious because that went way over my head. I don't, I thought she turned people to stone and shit. But anyways, we're in Wessex and shit um, for no good fucking reason. A, just to start some shit. You gotta be biker. B, because we were bored. This is how we started. This is how we got finished. I mean, but like, dead ass, y'all could have just chilled. Y'all could have fortified Cadigan in case the roost came back. Like, they're not going to. But still, but instead, it's just like, you know what? I ain't got enough shit to do. So let's go fuck up these people day. And here we are. So we waiting. We're waiting on Alfred and his people to show up. So we can see who really about this life. <coughs> Which might not go well. <coughs> it probably won't. The way Ivar keep looking at Harold, he want Harold out of here. We probably gonna try and make that happen. I don't know happen. why. I don't know. Ivar low key hating on Harold. Yeah, Cause Harold gave up the throne. He out here with you. He's ready to die with you. What's the beef? I don't get it. <laughs> I maybe, didn't kill your brother. You killed your brother. But What's maybe the when they had that little conversation, Harold was basically saying like. I never got nobody to talk to. I'm alone all the time. My wife don't really love me. Like these people don't really like me. Maybe he just gonna be on some, you know what? I give up. Maybe I burn Victor won't even have to do anything. Maybe he just ready to go on some Goonhild shit. Meanwhile, in Cadigate, we got Ingrid out here blinding people. Savage. So now, a witch. This is the second time a witch been in charge of Cadigan. But she, that's, that's how we're going to end the series? A witch is in control of Cadigan? Hey, man, who who knows? Who the Who fuck? else going to take it? I mean, yeah, but something could still happen to her. She could have a power trip and we just all murder her. We don't know. We don't fucking know. But she blinded Eric. But that's what the fuck he get. Yeah. It was deserved. Yeah, like, my husband wasn't even, like, over the horizon yet. Her her husband raped her. I think the same thing would have happened regardless. Either way. Whoever it was, she was going to do that shit. The point is, he wasn't even over the horizon yet. And you just on some fuck shit. And Uba found his golden land. I hope... I hope this is the golden land. I hope Floki's on it. You gonna stop making that face at me. I do not believe that Floki is dead. 
He was brought up in this but episode. But how he end up in the how he end up all the way over there? Maybe he cast himself ashore from Iceland. We did bring up boats. And this is where he landed. But he was brought up in this episode. I don't feel like Loki's dead. I'm not gonna take that right now. I still don't trust Otair. I don't care. Mr. Identity Theft. Yeah, every time we have a bonding moment with him, it's like the next episode, he give us a reason to like, want to fuck him up all over again. Does he fuck around and kill Uber and then become Uber? I'm sorry. I'm going to go with no. I'm going to go with no. Nice try. Nice theory. I like that. Thinking. But no. I'm going to go with no. I don't think he's a god really anymore. I don't, I don't think this is a test anymore. Maybe it still is. I don't know. He did say we got here because you believed it. So we still on Uba's beliefs. His hopes, wants, and dreams. Anything else? No. Good episode. It was all right. We got three more. And I need shit to get a little bit more spicy for my taste, so. I'll hold out for that. Anyways, if y'all picked up on something we missed, feel free to drop it down below. If you like our videos, please feel free to like and subscribe and come back and watch us watch more things. We'll see you guys later. Bye.